So today the architect is coming to discuss the plans for our new home, which will be, of course, on Kelly's property. Expect nothing less. Hey, Glenn. Matthew, <laughs> Hi, Kelly. Hi, Kim. Nice Hi. to meet Matt, you. Nice to meet you. Matt, you said mm. Matthew? Hi, Kelly. Yeah, nice Pat, Matt, yeah. Kelly, Kim. It's easy. When you guys are going to be living here, have you put any thought into where you might want things? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yes, we're going to be living like walking distance from their home, but ideally we'd still have like those private spaces. So focus some things out the back, maybe patio areas on yeah. the back side. Right. Mm -hmm. Is that a more, yeah, that's what we thought about. We were thinking open concept for sure. Uh, I don't know if I like that. You don't like open concept? I don't know. I, I mean, I'd like to keep my options open. OK. We can talk about that, though. We'll work out some layouts. Is that OK? Can that work? I mean, I feel like the architect just like asked like what we want. So Yeah, but we me... want to include mom, because this is part of mom as well. She has some ideas. Matt and I have talked about things that we want on our wish list. But when it comes to decision making, like Matt feels this need to get that opinion from Kelly. And it makes me feel like, like what's my place and what's the purpose of me giving my opinion to begin with? And what about a guest room when I want to stay over? You can't walk 20 feet back to the house? I like options. But we need like that privacy, like that's what we just talked about. I don't think I'm being unreasonable to have my own bedroom there. I'm paying for it. So that's the way it is. And Kim is just going to have to get used to it. Maybe I could talk to you about it, about setting up the house for an older person, maybe um, grip rails along the walls. You want to do grip rails now? And for a wheelchair instead of steps, we have a ramp. It can all be laid out so there's minimal okay. problems getting in and out. When it comes to planning 30, 40, 50 years down the road, for me, it's like, why? Like, why are you making that decision right now? I changed his diapers, and he's going to be changing mine. Are you going to say anything? I mean, I don't know. We kind of three have to be in agreement of what we're wanting. Even so, and I, I want guess... mom's opinion of like what she thinks we should do too, so yeah. that way we're all kind of on the same page. So thanks for coming by, Glenn. <laughs> Kim had the deer in the headlight look. When you build a house like this, it's there's a lot to it that people don't foresee. If you want to test a relationship, do this. Kelly's got her ideas, Kim's got ideas, and uh, Matt's just kind of standing out there in the middle hoping it all goes good. For us, like, we have a Pomeranian, so that's, like, something that would need to be taken into consideration, too, is, like, a good dog door to have in the house. No. You gotta feel safe. I don't want a doggy door. Why don't you want a dog door? Because I don't feel safe with it. Have you seen Home Alone, where the crook, the crook goes in the doggy door? And it's that big? No. They'll find ways. I don't want it. Like, we talked about this. Like, we want the dogs to be potty trained. We want them to go outside. Like, Yeah, but it's not a big deal, like she said, to just take them out. I mean, I just feel like I want you to take my side on, like, for this. Like, she's right. Like, that is home alone. They went through the dog door. You never know. I feel like this meeting is not really going as I expected it to go. I was really hoping that Matt and I would be more on the same page. I really don't know what to say right now because Kim has all these great ideas that we have discussed, but then at the same time, I am not sure if my mom is happy with any of the things that are being discussed right now with the architect. So it's put me in a situation where I don't know because I want both of them to be happy. Kim, have you heard of that saying, listen to your mother? Sorry, Kelly. We can only like, figure out if we actually want it later, because I don't really know now if it's something we do need. Because mom will be up here watching the dogs, or we'll take the dogs down there. But what if we aren't home? I will have a key. 
You're not having a key. Why? Because that's like, that's too far, babe. I don't think it's a big deal if she has a key. No. No, I'm not comfortable with I, that. I like it. Thank you. It scares me a little bit, not knowing if Matt's ever going to be able to set those boundaries. But I, I refuse to let Kelly have a key to our home. So what did you have in mind out here? Well, Glenn? we're just talking about roof lines coming so up So what do you here. think of it? Do you like it? Ceiling height the same. I do like it, but I do believe that we're going to have some issues. She hasn't built any homes, Matt. I know. So I have a lot more experience. I have more experience in my life. So I'm going to have to listen to that. No, I do. Yeah, I think you have a lot to No, I want to hear what you need to say about yeah. it. I promised Kim that I would have her back and I would be on her side with the decisions that we discuss, and I want to do that, and I'm trying to do it, but I know my mom's points that she's bringing up right now are valid. She's done all of this before. She knows who to call, how to do it. Kim and I are just learning this. It's our first home together. So as much as I don't want to disappoint Kim and I want to, like, us to do this together, it's a little bit hard when I hear all these great things coming from my mom and I know that what my mom is saying is going to be perfect. And you know, you've seen where we've built homes and Dad and I have argued. Mm -hmm. You've seen us. Yeah. So that's what you're going to have to get ready for. Well, do you think getting engaged and doing the home is going to be too much? I think it's going to be um, like be 11 much? on the stress scale. Yeah. Yeah. I feel that Kim is being a little too wanty. She wants a house. She wants a proposal, she wants a wedding. What else? This is putting a lot of stress on my son. So Kim needs to get with the program and just step back and let's just breathe and let's start with the house and see how that goes. We had drawn out our own pictures of like layouts. Which... You sketch some ideas already? Mm -hmm. Well, those would be good to have. Would you like together? my lookbook too, some sketches of mine? Anything and everything. Okay. Great. You made one too? You, yes. You didn't know that, did you? This is a really big issue that we need to figure out a solution to. If Matt doesn't step up and tell his mom, we have to make decisions to ourselves. I think it might cause a lot of stress on our relationship and then our marriage, you know, when we get to that point.